Welcome to The Breakdown, a special edition of The Breakdown, I guess. I'm with Tim, of course, and a guest today. We've never had a guest on the show before, Lori Wellborn. Welcome to The Breakdown. Thank you for having me. Now, you, uh, of course, are familiar with us here. You uh, used to volunteer and work with us here. Yes, and you guys are my pals. <laughs> So, of course, we wanted to bring you in to talk about the uh, the viral video that, that you've made. Uh, that must be incredible. The last time I saw it was like almost near three, three million hits. Where, where it was yeah, there. actually, it's been duplicated over 75 times on YouTube, you know, where they rip your video and then upload it onto their own channel so that they can collect hits. Right. So it's over three million now, Wow. if you count them. That's did you ever think that was going to happen when no. you did this? No there's a real issue with gender inequality in the world, and I think that people reacted to that. It's not just taking your top off. I mean, people do that all the time on the internet. They don't get three million views, right? No. Is, is it also the fact that they, you know, the mayor's in there and you're a, a columnist and that kind of thing? Is that driving it, do you think? Driving the interest? I, yeah, I think I've, I've been trying to analyze what about it would have captured people's attention and probably that it was displayed as if it was a, a really professional setting. You know, people thought that I was a real reporter coming in to ask a question to the mayor of the city. And the reason I took my top off is because I wanted to make the video interesting. You know, I don't like to do anything uh, too normal. <laughs> and Yes, I know. I've been with some interviews with yeah. you in the past. Going, okay, good. Yeah. Good job, Lori. We're yeah. going to have to figure out how we're going to make that work. And didn't it seem like a no-brainer if I'm going to ask the mayor of the city if what would happen if I went topless here than to, to go topless? Exactly. But I did give him a heads up right beforehand. I asked him if I could, and he kind of, you know, laughed and said, oh, that would be fine. Uh, I don't know if he knew that I was totally serious because we didn't know each other. You know, oh. I'd only met like once before and he seemed like a stuffy politician. So I fully expected him to say no. But then when he said yes, I was like, well, I'm not going to pass up this opportunity. <laughs> is it an issue that's close to your heart? Yeah. Uh, human equality is really close to my heart. Yeah. So it's not just that I want things to be equal between women. I want them to be equal between all people, you know, whether it's race or, you know, the gay and the and the, the hetero thing or, you know, all of that kind of stuff is really important to me. You know, and the, the Daily Mail picked it up, one of my favorite websites. Yeah. Well, you know, it only had gotten to about a thousand hits when I got a call from the first TV station. Yeah. And that was uh, Jillian Richards, who worked here as well. Yeah. And she works now for CBC. And she said, oh, we're all watching it and laughing. And holy cow, I can't believe you did that. Would you, would you be open to having an interview? And by the time I had an interview with them later that day, it had hit 5,000 hits. And I was completely floored. But I still only thought that it would you know, get to a, 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 a limited number just because I thought only people who knew Walter or myself would be interested. Right. Yeah. It, I had no concept that, you know, that CTV picked it up the next day, Kent Mulgat uh, interviewed me, and then it went national. And then it started right. to like, yeah, like with the Daily Mail. Yeah. That was that was huge. Yeah. Then a whole bunch of countries picked it up. So, yeah, I'm glad that I'm on the news for a good. I believe a very good reason, rather than you know, murdering somebody or you know. Well, it's a much better thing. Than yeah, somebody. much better. Yeah. We're walking into a pole like Ken. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that looked like it hurt. <laughs> well, thanks very much for coming down, Lori. Thank you. And uh, we'll see you next time on the breakdown.